So what's a still life mashup? You take two things <laughs> and then you draw them but together. <laughs> This month's guild meeting, we did still life mashups with all of our guild friends in two Zoom meetings. And so everyone picked two or more objects. And then we either created a character out of those two objects or somehow combined those two objects into one object. Mm -hmm. So I was combining Mormor's fish with Nana and Grandpa's pot. I was mixing up my plant babies with a teddy bear. The teddy bear Your is purple. Your plant babies. <laughs> Our seedlings. They are plant babies. You actually used colored Sculpey. You've never sculpted mm -hmm. with colored clay before. What'd you think? That was super cool. You sculpt it and then it's instantly painted. <laughs> yeah. So the pot that I used for the fish, it was in my grandparents' house forever. My dad grew up with it and they always called it the ot pot. And when my dad was an adult, when I was a kid, my aunt asked my Nana, so why do you call it the ot pot? And my Nana, who was from England said, because it's pretty, ot, you know, ot, A-R-T. <laughs> they always thought it was O-T, but it was A-R-T. <laughs> She meant the art pot. Mm -hmm. That's so funny. Yeah. I use Procreate, and here's my drawing, which is hand sanitizer and a crown. Making the hand sanitizer princess. <laughs> so you were using, what is this called? That where you, It's the mirror image across? <laughs> I think it's just called mirror. Yeah, so you drew one side and then it reflected the other side except for her hair and the crown. But it's a quick way to get a nice symmetrical, <laughs> especially the face. It made her very flawlessly symmetrical. <laughs> I love her freckles. Freckles all the way. Freckles on the ears and the shoulders too. She's so sweet. <laughs> and then shading. She's so beautiful. This is Sam and I drawing. What are you mashing up? I'm mashing up BB-8 and Ty's headphones. And I'm mashing up sunscreen and sunglasses. Our guild friends did such really cool things with the mashups. We always try to come up with prompts for our guild meetings that are really accessible. We try to make sure that we don't require any specific materials. You can do whatever you're comfortable with. If you want to build with Legos or if you want to draw with a pencil or if you want to color. Yeah, that's right, Sam sculpted this time. We try to come up with something that's going to encourage creativity, because I think anywhere on the internet you can find a million tutorials on how to use materials and how to draw certain things specifically. We want to do fun, creative, easy projects. Using a hoo hoo alcohol markers this time. The blue there got blended, and you just basically color back and forth, and so you can really easily blend a lot of, of colors. And you can also use light gray color or a, just a paler version of something as a shadow color, and you can add layer upon layer, and it'll just keep getting darker. Just super neat. That's Aji to eating an avocado. That's nice. You switched her to a vegetarian. <laughs> That's good. <laughs> Much safer that way. What was your favorite mashup of uh, someone else's? Uh, I really like Sean's Kirby. You it's... always say Sean's, but yeah, I did too. <laughs> it's our... it's kind of a little like derpy. <laughs> it's our first pixel art at a guild meeting, I'm pretty sure. Sam, which one's your favorite? Um, they're all good. Yeah. I can't decide, so they're all good. They are all good. So I used a Posca pen to do some highlights. The sunscreen character ended up looking like Daisy Duck, I think. She's kind of got like the Daisy Duck shoe vibe <laughs> and the lips yeah. kind of look like a beak. She also looks like a banana in a bathing suit. <laughs> <laughs> Here, I took the Virgil little sock monkey thing and the Among Us imposter. Both things that we've made on this channel. Uh-huh, both things that we made out of socks. The sock monkey was already kind of a mashup because it was a sock monkey based on Virgil. So that's sort of the two of those combined. Okay, I love the tongue <laughs> and the backpack. So perfect. 
the simple details to make sure that you got both of them well represented. You made really good choices for what things were representing each person. I like how both Virgil's spacesuits have the little patch pattern and they both have eyeshadow. Yeah, the eyeshadow. It's um, at first I thought it was that you were gonna start blending your shadows instead of doing the graphic shadows, and then I realized, nope, <laughs> that's the eyeshadow. There it is. I decided to do the eyeshadow on the Among Us one purple because it just looked better mm -hmm. than the brown. Well, I mean, Virgil has purple hair, and I think he's had purple makeup before, right? Yeah. He had a, a sassy day, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> One of the more recent ones, they showed that when he gets excited or something. Oh right, when he's happy. When he's happy, he gets the purple eyeshadow, the purple and glittery. <laughs> there you go. What did you guys think of Still Life mashups? It was epic and amazing. Yeah? Epic? Whoa, I wasn't expecting epic. <laughs> it was cool.